Hi, boys and girls. Mrs. Baird here with all of my musician friends. We are so excited today. Spring is in the air. Animal Kingdom is coming alive. And today, just about all of my songs and musical activities have to do with this animal. I'm going to imitate it, and I want all of you to say this after me. Can you all say, ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. So, Jenna, what kind of an animal goes ribbit, ribbit, ribbit? A frog. Exactly. So today is kind of like frog day. Lots of songs about frogs. And a lot of people say frogs go croak, and they do. But another popular word is ribbit. Now, we are going to be singing a song. It's a really cool song called Frog by the River that will give us the perfect chance to use our singing skills and to use our playing skills. Now, boys and girls, I am showing you one of my favorite instruments here. This is called a frog wiro. You will notice that the frog wiro is shaped like a frog. It is a percussion instrument, so we will use a stick. You will notice that he has a very spiky back, a very spiky spine. We can create rhythmic sounds by taking our stick and scraping along this frog's uh, spine. Um, musician friends in the back, can all of you hold your frog wiro? And I want all of you to echo me. Can all of you do this? Rip it, rip it, rip it. Rip it, rip it, rip it. Good job. Now, when I when I went rip it, rip it, rip it, I pushed my stick away from myself to play those eighth notes. So if you do that, you'll get a better sound. Boys and girls in the classroom, I know you don't have an instrument in your hand. Can you hold one hand like this? Can you take two fingers from your other hand? And when we go, rip it, rip it, rip it, can you play the rhythm? Okay, so if you have an instrument, play it. If you don't have an instrument, use your fingers scraping on your hand. All right, we're gonna try this again. Can everyone echo me? Rip it, rip it, rip it. Did you hear some different sounds of the frog's voices? Let's listen to Mrs. Baird's. I'm gonna play it by myself. My frog is a medium size. Mrs. Ransom, can you come up to the camera and demonstrate your frog, Wero? Take a look at Mrs. Oh my goodness. That's a big one. Can you demonstrate for us? Wow. Did that have a lower voice, boys and girls? Was that a lower sound? Yeah. That's right. Because larger instruments make lower sounds. I would like for my friend Jenna, can you hold up your frog? Hold it way up high, and so we can see it. Jenna and I have twins. Jenna, can we play rip it, rip it, rip it? Yeah. Did you hear our sound? Yeah. Was it high, medium, or low, Jenna? Um. Kind of what? It was kind of low. And yours was light and mine was low. But really? Different. Well, mine might be a little bit bigger. Uh, would you say that our sound, Jenna, was it a little bit higher than Mrs. Ransom's big frog? A little bit higher? Yeah. It yes, was it was. Bit higher. That's right. So ours, a little higher. Thank you, Jenna. So size matters. Jada, can you come with the most unusual frog, Wero? Can you can you play rip it, rip it, rip it? Did you all hear that? It was amazingly high pitched. Show us again, Jada. It's because Jada's frog is very, very what? Small. Small. Thank you. All right, ladies, y'all can go back and we're gonna do our whole song now. So boys and girls, you can tell that size matters when it comes to music instruments. So this time, I am going to see how smart our musicians are and we know they're smart. If I play the song for you, do you think you can find rip it, rip it, rip it? I want you to play it when I get to it. All right, let's see if they can find it if I play the song on my recorder. My friend Mrs. Winkler over here is going to play an alto xylophone in the background. All right, see if you can find rip it, rip it, rip it, rip it, rip it, rip it. Mm -hmm. Well, this time, 
time, a little more challenge. I would like for you to sing after me. Please be my echo, me first. Frog by the river. Frog by the river. Sings a happy song. Sings a happy song. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Now who can sing along? All right, they're really good, aren't they? Boys and girls in your classroom, even with your mask on, can you see if you can echo softly? I'm gonna sing two lines, me first. Frog by the river sings a happy song. Go. Frog by the river sings a happy song. Awesome, my turn. Ribbit, 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 now who can sing along? Ribbit, 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 now who can sing along? All right, now I'm going to sing all four lines, all four lines, and see if you can remember how to sing it back. Me first. Frog by the river sings a happy song. Ribbit, 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 now who can sing along? Go. Frog by the river sings a happy song. Awesome job! And now we're ready for a whole production. Everyone, get your frog ready. Miss Winkler's gonna play along. I want everybody to sing the song two times in a row. Are you ready? One, two, sing with me. Frog by the river sings a happy song. Rip it, rip it, rip it. Now who can sing along? Frog by the river sings a happy song. Rip it, rip it, rip it. Now who can sing along? Awesome. And we're going to do one step better. I think it would be really fun this time if we all sing the song, but on rip it, rip it, rip it. What if we let one frog, one voice sing that part? Wouldn't that be cool? Yeah. yeah. All right, Mrs. Ransom, can you come up? I'm gonna let Mrs. Ransom come up. We're gonna sing Frog by the River sings a happy song, and I want you to listen to Mrs. Ransom sing the rivet part. Thank you, all right. Here we go. Frog by the river sings a happy song. Shh. Now who can sing along? Awesome job. Can I have my friend Jenna come up and she's gonna go. Awesome, all right, let's sing until we get to her place. Ready, go. Frog by the river sings a happy song. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Now who can sing along? Awesome, Jada, you come up and show us your frog solo this time. Ready? Frog by the river sings a happy song. Now who can sing along? Awesome. Can everyone do it this time? Last turn. One, two, here we go. Frog by the river sings a happy song. Now who can sing along? And now for our big ending. Can everyone with your frog, can you pretend you're on a swamp right now? And I want you to improvise. Just play any sound you want while Miss Winkler and I improvise softly. Have a great day, everyone.